today is all about photography and video recording. Most of our dancers know that we have pretty stringent policies on this, and there are so many reasons as to why. You know, whether you're dancing with us or others, you should always ask the instructor or the director before you just start taking pictures. This is for so many reasons. Sometimes there are release waivers that need to be involved, and if not everybody gives consent, you don't know who has allowed for media releases and for being permitted to take pictures. Other cases could be studios are really selective in what they publish and how their items are shared. And they may not always want things being posted per se or taking picture of, especially as shows are being produced. A lot of that is not meant for the public audience to see. And I know that everyone now has cameras attached to their phones and we're always wanting to take photos of everything, but this should be something that you ask before you do. And there may be stipulations with that if you do. The same can be said for performing and whether or not you're allowed photography there as well. If you go to professional level shows, you're typically not permitted to take photos. These are props and costumes and parts of shows that have a lot of work that gets copywritten and different licenses that are required. You want to make sure that you're refraining from taking pictures if they're, it's not an appropriate time. Now when we talk about video recording, this is a whole other ball of wax <laughs> that again comes down to a lot of licensing. And again, in the professional realm, you typically cannot go into a show and just start video recording it. There are music licenses that are involved and there's copyrights and all kinds of things that go into shows and classes and all these different aspects of what we do. If you are allowed to video record, again, you need to ask permission first. Sometimes your instructor may permit it, other times they may not. And they don't really have to justify that. If there's a reason why they say no, it's just no. We wanted to let you know that there are just more things involved with this than just a simple no. Our shows are typically never video, actually, I can't even say typically, our shows are never allowed to be video recorded because of music licensing. And it's, when it comes down to class, we don't allow video recording because of, again, music licensing. Even the videos that we produce, if you notice, there is never music involved due to the fact that even though, yes, we are a dance studio, until we're able to afford music licensing for the video aspect of things, we refrain from doing that because it's only fair that if I'm an artist and I get paid for my work, the artists that produce the music should be getting paid for theirs. And that's something we take very seriously at our studio especially given the fact that I've got so many friends in the music industry. I will see you tomorrow as we talk all about really awesome note-taking skills and why that's important and ways to help you work through some of those notes. I will see you then.